Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. And we're back <laughs> after a quick rest rumor. <laughs> breaker. Man, breaker Breaker you, 1 9. You look crazy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know. Uh, anyway, we're going to jump right back into this next. What would what, you like to call it? Part two? Part two, segment, segment two, whatever. whatever. Yeah, whatever. Uh, we're getting right back to it. You know what I'm saying? Back to the bones, to the brains of things. I mean, I told you, you're supposed to ask me any question that comes to your mind because these are my family. Well, yeah, well, you my know, people, these are my friends. You know, I was family. nice to you last time, you know. You know, like <laughs> I was saying, I was giving you a break. You're my boy and everything, but, you know, you know, I just need to talk about this one mother. You know, um, what's his name? Willie, Willie, Willie Pete. Ah, listen, Willie Pete. I told you three. First of all, no, no. I, I, let me finish up, though. What, what the hell is a Willie Pete? No, listen. I've heard of a repeat. Listen, I've heard of a sweet Pete, listen, a real listen, shooter, listen, a real okay, big man. What the hell is a, what's a Willie Pete? It is. Do me a favor. I know me and you go back a million years. I'm just now meeting Willie Pete, and. You, you can't tell how old he is. You can't see his face. I can tell you how old he is just by the way he talks. I know. He, he, you know he, like I said, he's about 23, 25. He has some good points. Get him that, no, he, you know what he yeah, is? He has to just see a little bit more. But Willie Pete is good. Willie Pete is good. And like I encourage everybody to watch the Boss Francis Coppola. Watch the jury report. You know, go ahead and watch Tom. Go ahead and watch Cindy. Also know as me, and go ahead and watch, you know, uh, you know, your girl. Oh, what's it that kind of doll? Oh, go ahead, go ahead, man, go ahead, go ahead. No, no, go ahead. I mean, yeah, get your plugs in. I'm like, I'm like. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. It's this one dude. Oh my God, he was cussing these fools out. He's talking about beating ass. Oh my God, I know he's in my. If I was, if I could just do it right now, I could give you his name. Oh my God, what, Willie Pete? No, not Willie Pete. This other dude is so tight. P. I. Will. <laughs> Listen, no more Willie Pete. Man. Leave Willie Pete alone. You leave Willie Pete. All right, all right. Well, I'm gonna leave that alone. Willie Pete gonna fry you I'm up. I'm gonna leave you old. I'm gonna leave that alone. He told, he said, he told us us old fools. It's all our fault. And it's I'm gonna leave that alone. Leave I'm gonna leave that alone because hey, nobody can fry me up for one thing. But I want to talk about you know, give them the face movement. Oh, the, the, I really want to move on. You know, hey, Willie Pete, no disrespect to you, know, to you and everything. We're just having a little bit of fun here. But, you know, listen to what you say before you open your mouth. Uh, you know, but give them a face movement. Let's talk about that. Let's touch into the depths of that. Why don't we start from the beginning? Okay, the, from the beginning is like, Boss Francis Coppola, you know, he's pretty much like me. We, we bumped in. I don't know how we bumped into each other, but one night I was on the, on the Internet and he was on the internet, and I, I think I had just done something. I think it might have been a Willie Pete reply. I don't know. But he hit me back, and he said, that was true knowledge, OG. And I'm thinking, you know, man, when this, when this cat hit me, he had just saw the video, and he just hit me. And for the first time, I said to myself, I am touching somebody who is not on here to listen to me spout out about this and that. You know what I mean? And he told me, hit me back and tell me who your favorite 10 MCs was. And that's how me in the Boss Fastest Couple of Okay, got not to cut you off, can uh, I ask you a question? Yes, sir. Just throw out a couple of his favorite uh, top MCs. <laughs> you killing me! No, I mean, you said it. I mean, he, you said he's your boy. I mean, he's your boy. boy. He is what, my boy. What, what, what is some of the song? What, you you put some song on lot. I can't I'm hit put, you with this time. I'm putting you dead on the spot. You putting me dead on the spot. Well, I'm your boy. And I know well, you know my favorites. So you listen to me. It's, and I listen to you. Well, and obviously he ain't your boy then now, is he? What? The boss Francis Coppola's my boy. Okay, if you boy, say he's your boy, that's he's cool. Boy. He's but I'm your boy, motherfucker. Just don't get it twisted. No, you you my okay. man. You my man. If you can't you even tell me two or three of those man. MCs and Well it's like, you know, I I did listen. And I do. I watch too many damn videos to focus on one person. I talk to this person. I talk to him, and his words over the phone. I'll let you. Know, his words he tell me on the phone are more worth more than anything I've seen on any video of anybody. And listen, those dudes playing Grand Theft, man, that's off the hook. Go ahead. Oop, my bad. No, we're doing okay here. We're rolling right along. We're giving the people what they really want. 
I have to. My, well, my I have to. You know why? Because yeah. I don't pull no punches around here because you wouldn't pull no punches either. That's true. You tell that's the true. truth. And speaking of truth, and that's I told you the I, biggest one. I wasn't ready on it. I watched the video. I understand why you think I didn't punch it? So you know, it's like, hey, I didn't punch it because you know this is our, you know, our first interviews, and you know, you know, I'm a tough cat like that. Yeah. So yeah. we're gonna move right along because you know, like I said, we in this whole thing, even what you do, and I haven't seen all your videos yet. Yeah. But what you do is basically you try to grind down to the truth. And that's always been one of my pet peeves. Is let's get it down to the truth. Let's get it down to the, the cranium, the bare facts. Oh, you trying to touch it on the brains? Well, no, I'm touching on a touchy subject with you, which I'm talking the truth. And I, I really need to know, and I think your people that, you know, subscribe to you want to know too. Yeah. And I'm just going to just jump out and say it, friends or not. You know, right. are you a liar? Have you lied on YouTube to get bitches, females, sex, Money, promiscuous, whatever. Have I lied on YouTube? Yes. No. I've not lied on YouTube. Have I exaggerated a story? No. Have I pushed my voice in a manner to where I could flim flam people? Have I used the old Jedi voice trick on these people? Yes. I, I pulled the old Reverend Feel Good. Yes, I did. Reverend Coffee. He does. You oh. know. He ain't supposed to say real names. Well, he's a real Reverend. He's a strong and he's a good Reverend. But, you know, the thing is, when I do my vocal thing, it's a power. And this is, the, look, this is what I'm talking about with Willie P. If you listen to Willie P's voice, you can fall into the way he speaks. And true power is to show the face behind the voice and ultimate power is to admit when you're wrong and accept someone teaching you something that might be better than the way you think and that's what I invite on the real AIX and everybody from Father Judgment to the Midnight Rider which they destroyed and, and you know I don't even want to talk about what they did to the Midnight Rider go ahead well, I, you know, I, you know I, I agree with a lot of things you say, but I think what some of the problems you have is the choice of the words that you use, you know, like ultimate power and stuff like that. No, it's just the right thing to do. Well, you know, um, think, the thing with me is like, look, when I talk about power and, and ultimate power, all the people deserve to have the power. It's like... Those people who have been controlling us throughout our entire existences have always had the power. You may have the power, but if you just give us something, your power will be obsolete. But no, you want to drain and destroy the base in which you need to feed off of. And that's what I'm saying is the problem with our country. That's and understandable. That ain't got nothing to do with nobody else on the internet. That, 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 that's what I'm talking about. That's, that's what we're trying to tap on. Yeah. Because... Power or not, uh, the power is in the people, and the power is in the information, and it's how you digest the information. And that is the truth. And that is it. And on that note, that is the end of that. And I like to say, I like to give my man not only just daps, but love, right on up, and peace, you know, and do. prosperity. Okay, you know, and there's a few seconds left, and and the thing is this. We don't owe anybody anything but a better tomorrow. True and that. everything we fight for and everything we argue about is all linked to the same battle. If you're taught one way, then you're taught that way for a reason. You need to find out why you hate somebody and why you disrespect that person. And the only way you're going to get that answer is to ask that person why. Why do you hate me? Why do you dislike me? Why do you call me nigger? Why am I a lesbian? Why am I a slut? Why am I a cracker? Why am I a nigger? You need to ask that question. Why? Because if you don't ask that question, you know, then what happened? If you don't know why you hate somebody. I have a different opinion on that one, so I'm going to let you finish. What? You want me to do it? No, no. I, I mean, I understand what you're saying, but... Um, I, I agree with what you're saying, but my whole thing is, you know what? If you hate me, I hate you. I have no time. Oh. 
I have family. I have people that love me, people that care for me. And I...